Chapter 2 The worst things always happened to Kisten when she was minding her own damn business. She always steered clear of trouble and never intentionally put herself in harm's way. Nonetheless, it seemed she was always dealing with some form of bullshit. Today was no exception. Clutching her purse to her chest with her tightly bound hands while sandwiched between two burly, combat-ready men, Kisten eyed the man sitting on the loveseat across from her with malice. He ignored her obvious hatred. Fucker. I find her reactions odd. Kisten had been so intent on killing the man with her death stare, when he spoke it caught her off guard. No one responded. He continued without encouragement. Most women would be screaming and crying. She is merely pissed. Great. She'd been kidnapped by a fucking genius. Rolling her eyes, she switched her attention to the door behind them, attempting to will someone to find her, and ignoring the man's golden gaze. He wasn't a droid. In fact, none of the three men in the room moved like a machine, but their eyes glowed, proving they were all, at the very least, 60% computerized. Of course, that bit of knowledge didn't help explain why they'd stolen her from the street. On a normal day, she was better liked by AIs than anyone. In the human world, she was considered odd. It seemed today she was an oddity to both sides. Awesome. I'm tempted to remove the gag, the guy to her left said, drawing her attention. He was a blonde giant who took up too much space. It might be fun to hear her describing all the ways she intends to disembowel.